Hey Alaska, Pastor David Grisham here with Last Frontier Evangelism. Today I want to talk to you about throwing stones. There is a scripture in the Bible in uh, John chapter 8 that a lot of sinners misuse uh, out on the streets. And a lot of Christians are under a misunderstanding about this scripture. And it's where a woman is brought by the Pharisees before Jesus and they say she is caught in the very act of committing adultery. And they say, well, now, under Moses' law, such a person should be stoned. But what do you say? Now, and they say, and Jesus' response, of course, was, let he who is among you without sin cast the first stone. Now, why do sinners misunderstand that scripture? Well, very simply because the sinner is not looking for the truth. They're looking for an excuse that, for there to be no conviction for their sin. And so they interpret that scripture to mean that unless you're perfect, you cannot talk about anybody else's sin. You should not say anything about someone's sin unless because you're casting stones. And a lot of Christians also misunderstand that scripture, but they misunderstand it for a different reason. Most of the, most of the time Christians misunderstand it is because they don't actually study the Old Testament, so they don't understand the context of the question because it was asked in the context of the law, and that's Old Testament. So the Pharisees said, under Moses' law, such a person should be stoned. What do you say? Well, let's go back and look at the law. The law says that if you're caught in the act of adultery, you should be stoned. So she was caught in the very act with a man. So the million dollar question is, where was the man? Why were they gonna stone the woman and let the man go scot-free. See, if you go back to Leviticus chapter 19, or you go into Malachi, it talks about how unequally uh, enforcing the law, or unequally applying the law, is an injustice and is a sin in and of itself. So when Jesus said, let he who is among you without sin cast the first stone, he was actually saying, hey, if you can stone this woman and you can enforce the law without breaking the law yourself, knock yourself out. So that's what he was saying. This, this scripture that sinners use on the street against you actually has nothing to do with judging. It has to do with Jesus once again pointing out the hypocrisy of the Pharisees because they were claiming to enforce the law and yet they were breaking the law at the same time by trying to unequally enforce the law. They wanted to let the woman be stoned and let the man go scot-free. And Jesus was pointing out the injustice of that. There, there is nothing in the Bible that says that if someone is in sin that you cannot pass judgment on that sin. There is nothing in the Bible that says you have to keep your mouth shut when someone is in sin. What you want to do when doing ministry on the streets is you want to bring conviction on the heart of the sinner. If the sinner responds to you and says, well, let's let whoever who is without sin cast the first stone, then you know they're trying to get you to shut up and stop convicting them about their sin. But don't shut up. Don't stop convicting them about their sin. If you want to learn these kinds of things and much more, about what it's like to go out on the streets and preach the gospel and the things you're going to run up against out on the streets, then give us a call at 806-382-3121 or you can email us at lastfrontierevangelism at gmail.com or you can look us up on Facebook. We've got a radio program coming here in Alaska soon and we've also got a website going up. So keep, keep your eye out for us. Do you know Jesus? I know Jesus. Let's talk about Jesus again. God bless you all.